Hi, this video is about the Maps SEO Dominator WordPress plugin. Um, I'm just about to release it, so right now what, what you see is version 1.1. <clears> 1 .1. <clears throat> so when you see this video, it might be uh, slightly different, but um, it'll at least have what you see in here, and I've got a lot of updates planned for it. You can see it over here. If we click on Maps SEO, it's actually going to, this website is slow, it's not the plugin. This is the main uh, thing that you're gonna see to get started, and you're gonna input certain things um, in certain places, and it's gonna give you some suggestions based upon that, uh, based upon what you input in terms of what you need to do. And there's some really weird stuff on site that can be done and need and should be done some stuff that you would not expect so actually um, i ran this for my own website and it didn't give me like a super great score um, there are definitely some things that can be done and so you can go into the logs this is uh, really useful for, uh, especially if you have a, a site with uh, multiple locations um, it can make it pretty easy to kind of do multiple run multiple locations or if you 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 uh you make some edits to a page um, and try to improve it you can run again with edits <clears throat> or you can just run again without edits um, or if there's like a new field that, that comes into play so let's say oh i've got a logo url okay so we got logo url.com all right um image url oh description well it didn't seem to load this perfectly uh so let me actually pull up this right here so let's 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 go ahead and fill this out <clears throat> this should be fixed uh, post haste very good chance by the time you see this it will actually it should actually load what was put into here uh, Texas and it's 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 really nice to put in um, like your map URL all right uh, so let's say I want to add oh I got a, so, an, a third a, th a third social account URL.com and we've got some tar a target keyword, LSI keywords, and then keyword modifier. So a keyword modifier would be um, if uh, like company um, is a good one, like if it, it, or repair. So like for a roofer, basically you can apply repair to like all of their all of their keywords. So roofing city. Um, roofing repair city um, and so stuff like that. Sometimes company is a good one that basically you can just tack it on to pretty much every keyword that you're going after. Um, and you want to put in uh, your your hours. It's possible that this would still fill out when it when it ran. I'd have to check. And then you also want to put in your geo coordinates, uh, which if you go to your maps URL, you can grab it from there. I'll go ahead and show you that. Okay, so I'm in my maps right now. And if I, let me actually just uh, copy this. And we're gonna open my notepad. This is just gonna make it a little easier to see. So what you can see uh, is there is a place right here. See the at, these these are the geo coordinates. So actually what you can do um, is go back in here and paste it. So we're gonna run again. And this website is slow. I need to I need to make some speed improvements to it, but uh, typically it runs very quickly. Okay, so it's giving me a 37.5. Um, it's also spitting out um, uh, the uh, semantic code. So you wanna uh, you wanna put this uh, in, in your in, on the on the page that is that is linked to from your Google My Business page. So you go to your uh, Google My Business page and whatever this URL is. So if you have multiple locations with multiple pages, then that is the uh, that is where you want to put that, and you don't want to put it on other pages. Um, my title. Um, so you, you know, there's there's a few suggestions that if you don't have certain things in your title, and this is actually one of the most important places, you want to have uh, your main keyword and your and your exact business name as it is in your Google My Business. Um, or else you could actually get suspended. Now this is the one field where if you're doing a home page field, you can kind of uh, ignore this. But for an inner page, you actually want to have your. I would I would want to have internet marketing service. I think that's what I'm. Uh, where is it? Internet marketing service. If if it was an inner page, you would want to have that in your slug. Um, and then some H tags suggestions. Uh, and I'm just gonna kind of quickly go through this. I, I, I obviously I could use some improvement. Like I've, there's some other things that I've done that that rank uh, help me rank really really well in the maps already. Um, and so you know there's but there's still always more that you can do. So you don't need you don't uh, 
you don't need to have everything on here or else you're just going to absolutely not rank. But th this is definitely, uh, I, I would rank better uh, with, with these these suggestions in here. I just have other things to do. Um, semantic code, I already have semantic code. I have my Google My Business embedded. This is really important. So it seems really obvious, but uh, a lot of times I see people and they don't do that. Um, you want to geotag your images, um, which I thought I had a geotagged image, um, but I guess I don't. Um, so that's actually uh, really useful. Um, so the, 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 I, this is um, going to give me a few tasks uh, to add uh, some images here um, and modify my H tags as well. So to where I think that this gonna this is gonna help my my maps listings. Um, I at this time I have quite a few. Um, improvements planned, some things that kind of do some of these things autom automatically for you, uh, and some additional checks that can be done that are a little bit more complicated. But I think this is going to be a really great start, and it's going to actually prevent, help prevent uh, suspensions as well, uh, because there's certain things that if you do, if you don't do, you're more likely to be kind of uh, a suspension or, or suspension review is more likely to be triggered. So definitely let me know. Uh, shoot me an email, david at uh, digitaldominationdojo.com if you have any questions or you have any issues, and we'll go from there. Thanks, um, and have fun. Bye.